Back to the bargaining table for the NFL and its players after a judge ordered both to start negotiating again, and this time they're under the supervision of a mediator from the judge's own court. Carolyn Scott Soroka live in Minneapolis. Any progress tonight, Scott? Well, Mike, at this point, mum is still the word. That's about a $9 billion a year question. This morning, two players, two owners, a whole host of lawyers, and the NFL's commissioner walked into the federal courthouse here in Minneapolis. They are still at it at this hour. Now, we can show you some video. Minnesota Vikings linebacker Ben Lieber was one of two players to attend mediation with Magistrate Judge Arthur Boylan. NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell, who was last year when the Vikings were forced to play the Bears at TCF Bank Stadium, did not address the media on his way in. A handful of reporters sat outside the judge's chambers on the ninth floor the entire day. The only activity we witnessed was a run for bottled water and deliveries from Jimmy John's and Dee Bryan's. Hardly anyone even came out for a bathroom break. Lawyers for the retired players were also at the table. Talk about the progress. I can say that we're talking and I think we're in earnest. I think they're honestly uh, talking about things that uh, need to be talked about. Um, and, and I think everybody is, uh, is honestly uh, and openly uh, discussing uh, the things that they've talked about before, obviously, but I believe they're beginning to uh, look at them in, in, in earnest. It is also very important to mention that this mediation was mandated by a federal judge in St. Paul, the same judge who is trying to decide if the NFL's lockout is legal. Still, the very fact that these two sides have come together face to face to talk about the issues is pretty large. They have not done so in at least the month. That was when, uh, when the agreement, the collective agreement, the collective bargaining agreement dissolved. That's when the, uh, the players' union dissolved and also when the NFL locked his doors. Carl Eller, who just came out, said, you know what, we're going to work a lot more this evening. So who knows, they'll probably come back to the table again tomorrow. Mike and Julie. See how it shakes out. Thanks, Scott. Sure.